Yo, what up? Bro, yeah, because he went to my school, invited me out for the fashion show, first New York Fashion Week. I won't miss another one. That's 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 a promise. I, like all I care about outside of football, music, clothes, video games, and like art. But like all that really comes together. Since I was young, I wanted to ball player. My team don't settle. We need it all. Boy, watch out, cause my style ain't nothing you used to. Play too close, we might lose. Okay, okay. This thing is still coming along. I want somebody the professional to come in here and just hide the wires and stuff, but. What are you playing on? These, these three games right here, Call of Duty, 2K, Madden. Might get back on Apex now, they dropped a new season. Fortnite's kind of dead to me. GTA, everybody still plays GTA. Is this what you, uh, what you do when you're not playing football? Oh, absolutely. Off season, I try and, I don't know, I try and stay busy. Okay, yeah, these dudes are about to kill me. Oh, well. Growing up in Baltimore, just don't want to be outside too much. You get dangerous out there. So, I mean, every, everybody plays video games. Like, I mean, I don't even, they start off with Madden. My sister used to just kill me 24 seven. Yeah, she used to break me like, I'm mad at my sister. I would just run and gauge it and she would just throw it over my head every play. What game you Probably Call of Duty, but like I took a break, so like everyone just seems to like, oh, nope. Yes, sir, give me that. Yes, sir. I took a break, so you know, I gotta get back into it. This right here, it's one of my most prized possessions as of late. I had to get this framed, uh, Kobe jersey. Made it out to me. Not really supposed to touch this glass, but uh, well, from rookie premiere, Panini, you know, they set it up where everybody received a Kobe jersey just through making relationships, you know, and fulfilling promises. They said they would give me one where he signed it and made it out to me and they definitely stuck to that word and I got one of the greatest things that ever come through my possession ever. And I'm proud of this jersey. That mindset, that Mamba mentality, nobody's nobody's like that anymore. They don't make people like Kobe no more. It's just incredible. I would say my whole life. My mom was like very fashionable before she passed. That was like always like, she just liked to dress good everywhere. Um, definitely my older brothers, Aaron and Andrew, they, they taught me a lot. They would kill me if I said that they didn't teach me a lot. They used to clown me for how I dress because I just wear like what I like, you know, what I feel is good. They still do, even though I, I dress better than them. You know, it is what it is. Is there anyone specifically that you? Brands that I like the most. Or just like people, influencers. I love Kid Cudi. Uh, Kanye West is definitely like, he's my favorite artist. Like with fashion, I feel like he's, he definitely, like I tell everybody, he's like birthed like a lot of the streetwear and a lot of stuff that people wear nowadays. All of those other designers like served under him and he took the hard route through the design. He interned and, you know, for a person like that big to be so humble to just learn and, and grow, I think that's amazing. Uh, how do you describe your fashion sense? I would say definitely streetwear. Like, it's like streetwear I feel like hip hop inspired, skateboarder inspired, 
it's just inspired by so many different like things. Like, I don't know, it just has a lot of different flavors and every brand brings something different. And uh, I mean, I shop at a lot of different brands. Adidas has a lot of good streetwear. That's kind of why I went with them over like other brands. But I mean, like I moved, I moved around so much that like I just feel like I got a bunch of different cultures, and I've seen how so many people have dressed, and I just you steal a little bit from everybody, you make it your own.